Today's collectible spot, we're having a look at BitBot's Ginny Blind Box Figures. To check out more, you can head over to www.bitbots.co.uk. Um, on the side of the box, the different Ginny characters. Also shows you the number of availability. In this case, uh, most of them, while well, this one here is safe, for example, every 12, you, there's a chance of getting two in every 12. Also, one in uh, every 24, three in every 24, and so on. On the side, some nice artwork designed by Camille Descartes, uh, Adam Bertelik, uh, Malcolm Mole, Tom Coley, Valentina Grasso, and packaging by Anthony Everest. And on the back, oh, Ginny, once again, BitBots Toys Limited. So, obviously this being a blind box, Spot's just going to take a quick break. I'm going to get this all set up. And when we come back, we're going to get a better look at the Ginny blind box figures. With Ginny, you're looking at 12 blind box boxes inside this case. So we're going to go through each one of them and we'll see which ones we get. A little word to the big bird out there. Spot would definitely like to get this little kitty cat. Uh, there also seems to be one. I don't know if that's his that character is wearing underwear with a with leaves as well. This one kind of looks like a gas mask with a tie. This one looks like a minister or priest. On the other side, this one's kind of neat as well. I like that one. And there's also a little knight, um, a cat suit, and uh, a gentleman with green skin, a gentleman wearing a monocle. All right, so on the back, just uh, once again designed by and packaging. So let's open up the first one and see which one we get inside. These are all foil bags as well, so I'm going to need myself my trusty knife red and get the first bag opened up. Let's see which one we get inside. The first one starting this review is this one with the gas mask. Uh, they are posable. You can move the arms and also rotate at the head. Uh, really nice paint actually nice vibrant bright paint very clean as well uh, they have hands so well, they of course they have hands but they have openings in their hands for accessories although there is no i don't believe there to be any accessories no no accessories inside um, so maybe at some point they might have like little accessories that you could put in their hand very nice good way to start this one kind of actually reminds me of um was it Madman? Madman, that comic book superhero, Madman. Kind of lightning bolt in the... Yeah? See it? Maybe? Yeah? Okay. All right, let's put him to the side and uh, see who else is going to be joining him. Opening up the next box. Bring the camera back a little bit. Opening up the next box. As it goes... Oh, actually, there's something... Is there something else in these? Let's dump this out for a second. It says, thank you for purchasing me. This is Series Zero. Well, bring the camera in. Series Zero, more to come soon. That's from the folks over at BitBots. BitBots, created by Jats. All right, so let's open up the next foil bag. And in this one, let's bring the camera back. In this one, we get, oh, we actually get a duplicate. They actually have no names, just in case you're wondering. that There's no names or anything on the box. They just show you the numbers we've looked at already. Um, I'm going to call this guy Frankenstein with tie. Yeah, that's yeah. I know you don't you know you have to you don't have to say it. That, that's a horrible name. Opening up the next box. Come on, pussy cat, little meow cat. Meow. Hello. Let's put this. See which one we get here. Well, we get this. I said it looked like underwear. I guess he's wearing like a little sailor hat. 
or she's wearing a little sailor hat. She's got some leaves covering areas, leaf on the back. Oh, with a little heart and uh, arrow going through it. That's kind of cute. Once again, uh, articulation. It does rotate left and right, and arms rotate back and forth. On the underside, it actually on the underside it says BitBots as well. Moving that to the side. Let's have a look at the fourth box. Oops, try not to drop it either spot, come on. Opening up the next box, we get ourselves another Sailor with Leaves. Ahoy. Put that to the side. And the next box. And once again, if you are interested in checking these out and other things that the folks over at BitBots are producing, you can head over to www.bitbots.co.uk. Okay. No, I said UK, but that's neat. Look at that. I guess with this guy, you could have him really either way. According to the box, according to the box, he is supposed to face this way. And he's got all he's got one giant eye on his body and multiple eyes on his forehead or on his main head. But I guess you could kind of have it that way as well if you want just the singular eye adventure. Maybe you don't need extra eyes. Maybe you just want to do one eye. You can just do that one right there. Or again, you can flip it this way. He's neat looking, like a little alien guy. I like it. I like it a lot. The next box, the next blind box. Just put it to the side. I'm trying not, I'm trying my best not to make too much of a mess. Things aren't going so good with Rosalita, so I gotta tread lightly. Got ourselves another alien, little monster guy. Maybe I'll give this to her. I'll say, here you go. Thank you for cleaning up my mess all these years. That's for you. Thank you. The next box. I can feel it. I can just leave it at that. I could feel that I'm coming close to getting the little pussycat. It's just a hunch. It's just a hunch. And we didn't get it this time around, but we got the monocle wearing dress shirt tie wearing with suspenders guy. Very nice pieces. I like that they're small too. Small, but extremely, uh, extremely vibrant in paint. Nice. He actually might even be my favorite so far. So far. Next box. Next box. And let's get this opened up. The next award, the award goes to Duplicate. A duplicate right there. That's all right, I liked him before. I like him just as much this time, even though he is a copy. He's a replicant. It's a Van Damme reference. Opening up, opening up the next box. And let's see which one we got this time around. The next box, the next bag, inside. It wasn't the kitty cat, but it's the little boy or girl wearing a kitty cat outfit. I, I'm assuming it's a kitty cat outfit because that looks like a zipper. Again, really nice stripes. It might not be a cat. I'm looking at it. I'm thinking it's a cat. That's my, it's my guess. We make guesses in life. This is my guess. Not for life as a whole, but just for this Ginny. Ginny. The next box. By the way, we are down to three boxes. This is the third last box. You know who would like these? Christopher Walken. Christopher Walken would like these. Random, I know. Got myself the little kitty cat. Meow, meow, meow. Little, little, little kitty cat. I wonder if he likes milk. Little kitty cat with milk. I shouldn't really even generalize. Not all kitty cats like milk. Nor really should you be giving kitty cats milk. It's not really good for their tummies. But we got a little kitty cat. Does he know the martial arts? I'm assuming that's what he's got. Also looks like he's got a bat behind him. He might just kind of creep up. You look over and he's just like, mm, 
and then you fall back asleep and he's what, what? <laughs> I, I don't know favorite right here this is my favorite little kitty cat meow 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 I give him a saucer of milk he'll probably just break my arm the next second last second last container second last tote of goodness inside this box we got ourselves the knight knight character he's got personality or she she may have personality as too uh, so you can be a knight as a female as well female knights like that really really tall knight in uh game of thrones she's like 12 feet tall she's huge she's huge she would kick my butt easily easily and don't kid yourself she would probably kick all your butts as well i like it no sword or anything but i can make her a little sword out of paper mache paper mache the next and final actually this is the final box the final box in this journey through bitbots Ginny, blind box figures the final bag the final award goes to boy or girl dressed up in little kitty cat costume yum yum i certainly do enjoy these i like these quite a bit i gotta say paint on these really again nice very clean very nicely detailed especially like the the knight's face here and they're once again with these artist series and one of the reasons why spot loves bringing you guys videos like this is a lot of these artist series have really neat blind box figures we've gone through a couple of them over the course of these videos but uh it gives me a chance to show you guys some of the stuff that's out there you're welcome you're welcome uh, though really my favorite i might say is the kitty cat bar, bar, bar none kitty cat is my favorite and also i'm looking the kitty cat this was the only one he might have massacred all the other kitty cats as possible but he is the only one that survived he is the highlander of cats duncan mcleod i was gonna say something with meow Me meow cloud no that's not even it's not even close to being entertaining spot Needless to say, Spot was having a look today, today's collectible spot, we're having a look at the BitBots Ginny blind box figures. Stay tuned guys, Spot's going to have more figure reviews and more blind box uh, reviews heading your way as well. Thanks for watching, I'll see you next time.